round three of the NASCAR Cup Series for 2021 Green Flag. to the inside for third. Harvick draws a bead on leader Joey Logano. Already three wide down, halfway down that back straightaway. Continues here off of turn four. Four wide in the back. A side drop down the back straightaway. Carry that momentum in the corner and then slide up in front of Keselowski. Get up, get up, get yep, up. No, not going to happen. happen. <laughs> Chris Buescher trying to no, lead. Oh, get it. up. Oh, oh. For the first time at Homestead and he does. Big push. Chris Buescher for Roush Fenway Racing. His Ford comes off turn four, and he will win stage one from Brad Keselowski with Truex third, Byron fourth, Bowman fifth, Kyle Larson, and Joey Logano. So you see the nine, Chase Elliott trying to go three wide. He's got to now slide up. Whoa. And the back just came around. Boy, Brad Keselowski yeah. did, hit did him a huge a favor. favor. <laughs> that was... Uh... That was a lot. That was a wreck. It just didn't happen. That's what that was. Look how sideways the nine is there. I, I, well, I he mean, finally gathers it in. This. And the caution's out for Corey LaJoy. Big plume of smoke as he went off into turn number three. He gets it down to the track apron pretty quickly. Busher in the middle. How about oh, Danny this? Hamlin coming up in front of his teammate? Here comes the 24. William Byron to the inside. Green and white checkers. Byron. Who picked William Byron? Hmm. Well, who <laughs> who said they were going to come out in the second row and win this stage? Hmm. Where Ryan Blaney has made contact with Eric Almarola and quite a bit of damage to both cars. Yeah, here's Eric Almarola trying to sort of do a bit of a slide job there, Clint, on the 12 car of Ryan Blaney. He comes up, but but Ryan has too big of a run, and the 10 just. Can't stop the momentum, comes up, gets in the left front of the 12 of Blaney, turns him into the wall. Big damage to both of these race cars. One pass, gotta take it down. Yeah. Pass, right on you. I just really think Amarola just thought maybe he was gonna cut him a break or something, but yeah, the, I mean, the, 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 the spot just wasn't was there. there. Yeah, no, clearly he was up to his wheel. Pick up points, you're lifting, everything is different when you're doing that. Two to go. Byron with a four-second lead. His crew chief saying, stay away from that wall. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> stay away from he everything. Could, everything. He couldn't have been further away from it right there. Save me a bunch of fuel. Tyler Reddick for second. Slide job engaged. Nope. Uh, yeah, he made it happen. White flag, one lap to go. Sponsored by Credit One Bank. Did you pick the 24? I may have. Chip shot. <laughs> Twenty-three-year-old William Byron from Charlotte, North Carolina, came up through Legends cars. The wet, the East Series, the Truck Get Series, there, Xfinity, checkered flag. William Byron wins in Homestead, gets his second career win in his 111th start, and his team owner, Rick Hendrick, gets his 264th career win. Four wins away from tying Petty Enterprises for the most ever. How about that? Man, what a performance. Showed up when the time was right, without a doubt. Well, we started the season saying expect the unexpected. Best season ever. Boy, it's delivered. <laughs> it has delivered. But that's how we race. That's what we're going to get used to. Get used to winning, boys. <laughs> Some excitement right there. I believe that was Rudy Fugel, crew chief. 
Hey, so Pash, I remember his wins in the truck series. They are some of my favorites as a crew chief. The passion that he had, the excitement was awesome. And, and, and just the chemistry and the confidence that these two have in one another is special. This kid even does burnouts well. <laughs> See the order of finish on the left of your screen, two Chevys, Truex's Toyota and Harvick. Another top five for Harvick, he's the first Ford. Harvick and McDowell continue their streak of top tens to start the season, while Denny Hamlin does not. Uh, Self-inflicted penalty for too fast entering pit road. And Hamlin rebounded, but only to 11th at the checkered flag. Willie B is a NASCAR Cup Series winner for the second time. Jamie Littles with our winner. William Byron goes from 31st to first, leads 102 laps. Oh William, gosh. what can you say about the performance of this race team and your crew chief, Rudy yeah. Fugel, who wins for the first time in only three races? Yeah, I mean, that guy has uh, been huge for my career. He's the reason I'm here, and, uh, you know, I, I'm glad we could get him. And uh, he's just awesome. And this whole team did a phenomenal job. Uh, everybody, pit crew over the wall um, extremely blessed thanks god to for all the things that it takes to get to this level uh great boss and mr h jeff gordon uh, exalta this car looks really cool so i'm just I, I can't even believe it honestly it was a just a really smooth day and uh we worked hard in the winter on this track and can't believe it william you told me this race was going to be one under the lights on the bottom of the racetrack how much emphasis did you put on staying off the wall for this race yeah, I mean, you had to go the wall at certain times. Three and four was really fast up there. Um, definitely didn't do it as good as the Xfinity cars do it, but I, I used it when I had to, and uh, this car was just awesome. It, it really is a lot of hard work. I think we went to the sim four or five times this off season, and uh, just pays off, man. It's awesome. Congrats. This guy. Congratulations. There he is. Rudy Fugel gets the high five from his driver, Regan. For more great NASCAR on Fox content, subscribe to our channel. It's somewhere right around here.